All right, we're starting out our morning not so good. Um, Jason got up this morning and went to work. We're only gonna work like half day because um, we have plans tonight to go to the beach with our friends again. We're really trying to make that a weekly tradition. But he got to work and he got out and he walked around his car to go in the store and someone ran into the back of his car. And it had to have happened last night, like because he didn't see it yesterday at all. So we hate to like play the blame game in our own neighborhood, but someone in a truck, I haven't gone to look at it, I'm waiting for him. Um, someone in a truck, and there's only a few trucks in the neighborhood. So one of them is our friend. <laughs> so, we're trying to like look at the trucks and see who's parked where he was parked last night and try and decide if we're gonna file a report or just go and ask people. It's kind of an awkward situation when you don't know who it is, but they're also your neighbors. You gotta be kind of nice, but also like you hit my car. So I'm sorry, babe. I'm trying to. Yeah, it sucks. Okay, let's go look at his car. Police goes all the way over here. All right, I gotta try and show this without showing our license plate, but this you can like, see it right there. And then they got two tiny It's just spots. higher up on the fender, or on the bumper here. Yeah, oh, thanks. And then where else? Down here? And there's just little tiny dings down here somewhere. I don't know, it's hard to tell. Yeah, right there. There's that crease, and there's some other crap down there. This there's is another the one right one. there. Yeah, is they, this whole thing is creased all the way from here. To over here. Over here. Yeah. The whole thing is creased. So someone and they had to have something sticking out. To like really jab at that. And it had to be high. Yeah. So I don't know, it had to be a truck, but... Um... So now it's kind of awkward because the neighbor just drove past with his truck. And he's taking flowers to his wife. It was her birthday yesterday. Oh, this is awkward. Hopefully... I don't know if we should ask him. No. I don't know. Okay, so we're gonna kind of go and look at the truck. But that's like, that's like See where on this ground. it is. I know. Okay, I'm not gonna give away our neighbor's license plate, but there's nothing at hip height on his truck that could have hit ours and done that kind of damage. So, yeah, none of this could have hit and done anything. And that there's no, no scrapes on his car, so. It's not his, luckily. Um, someone basically like backed in, put a dent in the back of my car. Not huge, but you know, they creased the bumper and whatever. Um, okay, so he called our insurance. He's got to make a decision if we go ahead and file a claim. It's a thousand dollar deductible. Um, it could be more than that in damages. Um, to get a paint job is probably at least twelve hundred dollars. So it might be worth doing it. But we have to call the police and file and get a claim number um, in order to do it with insurance. So we are at Costco because we're out of milk and the kids can't have breakfast. We'll be right back. What did you say, babe? You have no desire to what? I've been eating too many lately that I don't really want one right now. Shocking. I know this is the first time. Very ever. first time. When they have it all the time, you're willing to eat it. I yeah. I, I just don't feel it right now. All right, we finally found a vitamin water for Abby. We're gonna get two of them and give it to her for her birthday. They haven't had this at Costco for a very long time, and we also got world's best mac and cheese for her birthday dinner, and then just regular groceries. All right, so I'll give you a little explanation on the masks. We are not required to wear masks in Costco. It's recommended again per our governor in the state of Washington. And this new Delta variant, I'm, I, regardless of what you believe on this virus, this Delta variant, variant is really dangerous. It's still sounding bad. It's not doing very There's well. No cars. You should just talk and then. I know, it. it's fine. There's people coming anyway. Um, <sighs> And people who have had the vaccine are now passing it to people who haven't, which means that we're putting our kids at risk um, by not wearing a mask in indoor places. So back to wearing a mask inside. I'm okay not wearing it outside. I usually stay away from people anyway. If you have not gotten your vaccine and you're watching this, please just go and get it. 
so we can get done with this. I really don't want to go backwards on this, and that's where we're headed. I kind of forgot that we were filming today. <laughs> it's already four o'clock. I worked on videos and just was home for a while, and I just got to the grocery store um, to pick up a few things. We're out of yogurt, and I need some orange juice for Abby's birthday dinner, or birthday breakfast, I should say. And there's one other thing, I can't remember what it was, but I don't get that at Costco. So, stopped at the grocery store, but I also went to um, Dollar Tree again, you guys. I think I should do a haul on what I found because some of the stuff is like name brand national stuff for a dollar, and this is not normally a dollar. I should look up prices on some of this stuff. So I think I'm gonna do another separate video. And let me know in the comments below if you like those kinds of videos, separate from like a vlog video. Sometimes it works because it's just like two or three things and I'll just include it in a style like a day video. But there's a lot of stuff there and there's stuff for Abby's birthday. Um, so it kind of is like ideas of what to do for a birthday maybe. And so, and I'll show you one of the things that I have that I didn't get at the dollar store that I'm gonna do for her birthday and why the color scheme is there. So, let me know. I'm gonna go ahead and do that one in a separate video, but let me know in the comment section of this video uh, whether you like the separation of that. I'm trying to decide what to do. I think I just canceled on our beach day tonight, our adults only beach night. One of the other couples canceled because their kids all got the flu. It's like the first, the cold flu, like virus and this little, flu virus is like the first little stuff that's going around after everyone, you know, quarantined and masks and stuff. So now, now germs are starting to hit. But it's like 97. It's 97 degrees outside and I'm just I'm not feeling well enough. I'm sensing a headache coming on and I just am not feeling like going to sit in the heat. My friends are going to get in the water. They have their paddle boards. And we were thinking of taking our kayaks, but I'm just not feeling like it. I don't really have much energy today. And I really want to go watch the new season of Outer Banks. <laughs> like, that's all I want to do the rest of the day. I feel like I've earned it. Kaylee's already watching it with her boyfriend. They've been watching it all afternoon. And it's keeping them out of trouble because they're very enthralled with it. But I've told them they can't tell me anything about it. So, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a relaxation card and use it tonight and just chill out. And we're also, I think we're gonna make Abby's, she really wants her birthday mac and cheese tonight <laughs> because we're going out for her dinner birthday. We're gonna go to Cheesecake Factory. Just me and her and Jason are gonna go out for her birthday night. So she's like, can I just have my mac and cheese tonight? <laughs> so I might do that but it might be too hot to cook it tonight. I don't know, we'll just have to see Ooh, that, that Jeep. I swear, I see Jeeps everywhere now. Look at that one, it's so beautiful. Oh, one day, Jason and I will have no kids left in the house and we'll buy a Jeep and we'll go on, on adventures. Or maybe we'll just rent them in Hawaii when we go. <laughs> Not this time though. spent more hours than I should all admit. <laughs> not all, all day. Give all me a break. Day. Not all day. Yeah. Not all day. Pretty much. <laughs> You've been binge watching Outer Banks. Kaylee and her friend has been watching it as well. Okay. Boyfriend. Sorry. Just, I'll correct <laughs> you. <laughs> okay. Fine. Um, <coughs> there one episode behind me. You're on episode six. Yeah, I just finished episode six. Mocked. So, yeah, you need to do your chores thing first thing tomorrow. Anyway, we're gonna end our night. Jason took us on a fun little sunset tour tonight, which was kind of cool. Yeah, just, okay. He went out with the kids. 
I didn't want to go out. I was watching my show. <laughs> but, um, and I did. I haven't felt good tonight. So, anyway, take care. And you'll see that Dollar, video, Dollar Tree video coming soon. So, take care. And Abby's birthday. I don't think I'll film tomorrow or Sunday. I think I'm going to take some days off. And then we'll be back at it ready for her birthday. So, stay tuned.